Let's just check back in with Spencer now. Spencer, no Barry Lewis tonight. We have a new high school football expert from the Tulsa world this week, Dean Rule. Yeah, that's absolutely right. As promised, Dean Rule joining us right now from the Tulsa World, breaking down a bunch of games from tonight. Dean, looking at tonight's matchup, the game of the week here, Booker T taking on Stillwater. Maybe not the best first half out of here by the Hornets, but made a lot of adjustments, I felt like, there at halftime, played a lot better in the second half. Some moral victories, is that, I mean, is that what they need to take away from this one? Yeah, I think there's a lot, if you're Booker T, you can learn from this kind of loss. You know, Stillwater is... Like you were saying, number one in, in this uh, class and for good reason. Uh, so there, there's a lot I think if you're Booker T, you can pull away from this, but you're now two and three. You know, you're running out of season to get some of these issues fixed. So you got to wonder what the Hornets are going to do and how they're going to do it in such a short amount of time. Yeah, they got to figure some stuff out in a hurry. Another good game tonight, McAllister. I've looked at them as one of the best teams in the state for all year long. They had a great run last year, but they had their hands full tonight. But what a way to pull out that game tonight. So yeah, I mean, when you got a uh, when you got Eric McCarty, you can do a lot, and for him to go score a two yard uh, two yard touchdown run as time expires, down by one, give it to him again, let him win you the game, and he does just that, scores the two point conversion, and they walk out, 34-33 win against Dell City. What can he do is what I got to ask. Sooners are getting a good one for sure right there. One last quick game, Rejoice Christian, obviously a big battle tonight. Their quarterback delivering again for him. What Eric McCarty is to McAllister, Chance Wilson is to rejoice. Threw for 438 yards, five touchdowns. This kid's something. When you got a quarterback like that, he's going to keep you in a lot of these games. And Claremore Sequoia, they're, you know, they're a surprise 4-0 team. They gave them rejoice everything they could, but rejoice still comes out on top here. Sure, but them and McAllister finding ways to get wins. That's what you got to do throughout the season. Now, that's just three of a bunch of great games. Be sure to check out the Tulsa World tomorrow. They'll have a breakdown of all of the other action. And Dean, thank you again for your time.